Yeah, Flags here in Roland are at half staff. His family lives here in Roland, but he went to school just a few miles down the road in Muldrow. And today, the school honored him with a moment of silence. We are both saddened and proud that one of our own served his country faithfully and made the ultimate sacrifice for his fellow man. Please stand in honor of Officer Wheeler as we pause for a moment of silence. It really brings it home when it's somebody that, that's been here, that you've known, that you've been around on a daily basis. Josh Wheeler graduated from Muldrow in 1994. His junior high football coach says his life should be an inspiration for students. There may not have been anything remarkable about him growing up, but, but something obviously clicked and he decided to make a difference in, in the world. You know, it's a very close-knit family here at the town, and so it really hit us hard. Wheeler's brother works for the city of Roland. His nephew is named after the Army Ranger who deployed 11 times to Afghanistan and Iraq. But yesterday, Joshua Wheeler died while rescuing nearly 70 prisoners from terrorists in Iraq. His name is already on the town's Veterans Memorial. Now a star will be added next to that for his sacrifice for our country. He was, he was a hero. There's no other word to put it. Now, friends and family members tell us they appreciate everyone's thoughts and prayers right now. Flags here will remain at Hastaff until after the memorial service to honor the fallen hero. Live in Roland, Brett Rains, 4029 News. Okay, Brett. Right now, the community planning that memorial service to honor Master Sergeant Wheeler. We're told it could be sometime next week. We'll let you know as soon as those arrangements have been made. Well, we just learned from the Secretary of Defense today new information on the raid in Iraq. Ash Carter says intelligence told them Islamic extremists were holding a large number of people in the compound that was raided this week. Carter says Wheeler paid the ultimate sacrifice to save 70 people. The sacrifice and decisive action of this courageous American in support of his comrades reminds us of the dangers that the coalition forces confront in Iraq. But also Wheeler's body will return to the United States tomorrow, welcomed by his family and the Secretary of Defense. Click Smarter tonight to learn more about Master Sergeant Joshua L. Wheeler. We have information on his service to our country. Just go to 4029tv.com.